Hi, I'm Bill Myers, and this is another one of my video tips of the week. In this week's video tip, I'm going to show you how to use a free program called Handbrake to reduce the size of your MP4 files that you put on your website. For example, this video file right here started out to be 50 megabytes, and using Handbrake, I cut the file size down under 4 megabytes. That makes a huge difference in how fast the video plays. For example, if I click it, Hi, I'm Bill Myers. You see that it loads quickly and the resolution is quite high. Now this is amazing because this video file started out as, like I said, over 50 megabytes and now it's down to 4 megabytes and it starts and runs quickly. I'm going to show you how to do that. First thing you want to do is download Handbrake. And you can find Handbrake at handbrake.fr. And once you get there, click the download. Download the version you need either for the Mac or for Windows. Download it and install it. And once you install it, it's going to look like this. And to run Handbrake, what you do is you click the source, and you choose the file that you want as a source. And we're going to choose this 49 megabyte video file, this MP4 file, that I produced from Camtasia. And then once we've chosen the source, we have to choose the destination. The destination is going to be Handbrake-1, so that we know that this is the version that we're creating right now. we we'll click Save. And then we're going to set some options. The first thing we do is we go to Video. We want to make sure this is the H.264 video codec. We want the frame rate to be, we want to start at 15. 15 is generally a good frame rate for a screen capture. We want to make sure that we put a check in Web Optimized. And then we want to click the Constant Quality. We want to put a check there. And Constant Quality, the further you move it to the right, the higher quality you get. On screen capture videos, a quality of 22 to 20 will give you great results. We're going to leave it at 22, which is a little bit higher quality, make a little bit larger file size. And then we click Audio. On audio, we're going to select the audio format to be AAC. We're going to select the mix down to be mono. Mono works great for screen captures. The sample rate to be 48, the bit rate to be 48. Then once we've set the audio, we're going to go over to picture. And on picture, we change the anamorphic to loose. And then we change the width to make it fit on our web page. In my case, I want the width to be 640, which is exactly half of 1280. Now that I have all this set, what I want to do is click the start button. And that's going to start the conversion process. And down here it shows you the percentage of the conversion that's going. You notice it runs very fast. And now it tells us the encoding is finished. That entire process took about 20 seconds. Now let's check and see what size the file is. This is the folder we put the file in. And here's the file we just compressed. Notice the file size is 3.7 megabytes. We started out with 49 megabytes. We ended up with 3.7 megabytes. But let's play it and see what it looks like. And you can see the quality still looks great. There's high resolution image on the screen, even though we reduced the file size by a factor of almost 90%. The transitions look good. The movement on the screen looked good. It really looks great. And again, we did that using Handbrake. I'm going to show you the Handbrake settings one more time, just so that you can see. And the main settings we did in Handbrake was on video. We set the video codec to be H.264. We set the frame rate to be 15. And you can set the frame rate lower if you record at a lower frame rate. We've set it to Web Optimize, which moves the metadata on the MP4 file to the front of the file so that it streams. And we set the constant quality to be RF22. On audio, we set it to be mono, sample rate 48 and 48. And on picture, we set it to be anamorphic loose, and the width is 640. And if you do that, you can greatly compress the MP4 video file and get great results. As I mentioned earlier, you can download Handbrake from handbrake.fr and click the download link. It's a great free tool for reducing the file size of videos, and you can import AVIs and MP4s. The output will be a small file size, fast loading MP4 that will look great on your web pages. I'm Bill Myers. This has been another one of my video tips of the week. You can find more like this at www.bmyers.com.